Sweetie, how are you, sweetie? Yeah, she loves her chest being scratched. Well, it seems my putting a crow out of its misery when it was going to die slowly <laughs> and painfully um, has stirred quite a lot of people up. They seem to think, some seem to think I was playing God, but I don't like seeing animals suffer. And that's, and I've rescued as many birds as anybody probably has. Birds of prey, crows, swallows, swifts, pheasants, um, <coughs> hedgehogs, bats. When I was living in the States, I rescued skunks, chipmunks, all kinds of animals. <coughs> 
so wild <laughs> to me if it can live and be rescued. Um, it's worth saving, but if it's suffering and dying, it is better to put it out of the suffering quicker. And that kind of playing God, I think I would prefer to do that, take an animal out of suffering, than to leave it in it to have a slow death. It just doesn't... I don't like suffering anyway, human, animal, or otherwise. So, this is not a bottle-reared lamb. This is just a very friendly lamb. So she came over to me of her own volition. Not because she was raised by a bottle, she was raised by her mother, who was over there. And there's other lambs that come up as well, as those of you who follow me know. So I'm sorry I disturbed a lot of people, but the reality of nature, the reality of life, the reality of farming, is there is death with it all. There is struggle, there is pain, there is suffering. And sometimes you or the animal suffers and recovers. And sometimes animals suffer and die. And if they're going to die, I would prefer to shorten their suffering. It's just not fair. Anyway. For those of you who know, this is Top Knot. Crystal, yes. She's such a lovely girl. She's so friendly. Yes. So, I'm so pleased with her and how she turned out. <coughs> She's a really beautifully put together lamb. So she'll be very good for breeding, even though her Markings are incorrect for a Zwart Bloss because she only has the top knot. She doesn't have the blaze. Who knows? Maybe I'll have to keep her and breed from her myself because she's such a friendly girl. Even though she's raised by her mammy and not a bottle baby. Isn't that right? Isn't that right? Yeah. <coughs> yeah, she's going off now to her mammy. <coughs> Anyway, I will continue showing the good, the bad, and the ugly, the beautiful and the unpleasant of farming because it's all I know how to do. I am only me, I'm only one woman. As somebody said, I am a white woman who thinks she's God. Yes, I'm a white woman. I definitely don't think I'm God. My significance is a grain of sand in the universe. I am insignificant in as much as what I can do, I do and will do for nature, for the dung beetle, for the soil, for my flock, for my animals, for my friends and for my family. So be kind to each other and let's stop suffering and my heart and mind goes out to the, all of those in war zones, famines, conflicts, all those kind of things. Peace be with you. <laughs>